hey guys welcome back to another tutorial on ANSYS and in today's tutorial I will be showing you how to develop line body model and we are going to assign the cross section to our model and this model can be then used to simulate the structural response uh, by considering it as a beam element so just go for uh, this in this in the project schematic right click and go for new component system and geometry so this will just name it to line body model this is very useful tool in analysis line body model i mean most of the analysis uh, uh, regard uh, if you consider the structural analysis are done using this line body models so just double click this geometry and it will open the design modeler so in the design modeler uh, go for units and select inches so after selecting the in inches go for xy plane so look at and then go to sketch polyline start from here and then it's okay. oh my god sorry go for polyline start from here vertical horizontal and again vertical now right click and say open end so after this let's assign the dimensions so this one is and between okay these and these just select control Z go for horizontal between these two no this is 72 and this one is 120 right click zoom to fit so once your sketch is done <coughs> go for modeling select your sketch go to concept and lines from sketches apply and then go for generate now our line line is done next we need to assign our our uh, cross section for this channel basically so go for again concept cross section and channel channel section so after that is six one okay the default uh, dimensions are uh, already in, inside the workbench so you can change it over here but i'm gonna leave this uh, we are not going to change the dimensions we are just uh, leave it as it is so Hmm. 
let's go to line body go for cross section select channel 1 and go to view cross section solids go to ISO here you can easily see your model which is uh, a line model and oops and with a cross section so these arrows just select this edge selection filter Select all the lines. Go for reverse orientation. Say yes. So yeah this is how you can do the line models and line body models in ansys workbench if you have any doubts on this one feel free to comment down below and uh, like this video and subscribe to my channel i hope you will thank you so much and peace